Everyone always asks me, what is the tallest bridge in Oregon? Not really, but Thomas Creek is an impressive structure and we will take a look at it. Many attractions of the southern Oregon coast are at Sam Boardman Scenic Corridor. One of its less popular stops to visit is Thomas Creek Bridge. It was created to have Highway 101 cross over a very large drop where Thomas Creek meets the ocean. Before this bridge, the highway had to go inland to an easier crossing. The bridge was designed by Ivan D. Merchant, who also designed the famous Astoria Megler Bridge. Construction was completed in 1961. There are some trails from a parking area to view the bridge. One is very short next to the highway to the closest viewpoint. The other is part of the Oregon Coast Trail and goes into the forest for some more secluded views. The trails can be rough like many coastal trails. Other parts can be nice and maintained. As usual on coastal trails, some caution should be taken as there are cliffs, slippery surfaces, and lots of erosion. There are a couple viewpoints that aren't great, but some glimpses of the bridge can be found. There's a cheese. Here's two more. The roadside viewpoint gives the closest and most open look at Thomas Creek Bridge. It isn't the most tourist friendly attraction of Sam Boardman. With no divider to the highway, it is not recommended to cross the bridge on foot. The beach below Thomas Creek Bridge looks very inviting. It is a nice clean and empty beach, but there aren't any trails going to it. Once I found a way I was willing to climb down, but it scared my dog, so we turned back. When traveling the bridge, you can hardly appreciate what an impressive structure it is. The bridge is most well known for being the tallest bridge in Oregon at 345 feet. The bridge type is called a worn deck truss. The deck part means that the road is on top of the supporting structure. A Warren truss means that it has longitudinal members joined by angled cross members forming the alternating triangles seen on the side of the bridge. This kind of structure ensures that no support is subject to bending or straining forces. Compared to other bridge designs, this one is actually pretty simple and efficient. The towers holding the bridge are called truss supports. The twin supports stand 270 feet above their foundations. 
They are made up of nine box or X shapes of 30 feet each. The total bridge length is 956 feet. It's lopsided, with the south side of the trusses being longer than the north. The bridge's condition is good because in 2017 a big restoration repair was done. Steel corrosion was repaired and the entire bridge was repainted. Thanks to a good design and upkeep, Thomas Creek is a solid bridge to rely on. Even though it can be hard to view, Thomas Creek Bridge is a thing to see on the southern Oregon coast. The bridge is an impressive structure that many drivers rely on without appreciating it. Impressed or not, drivers of Highway 101 would always welcome something that means one less curve in the road.